Hi, so in this video I'll be showing you how to use the TTP223B capacitive touch sensor. You can get these ones on the eBay for pretty cheap, usually under a dollar. So you shouldn't need to solder on any of the pins or anything, they should already come attached. You should be able to see that there's three pins there. There's the SIG, which will be used for transferring the data across. There's the BCC, which will be used for the power. And there's the ground, which will be connected to the ground port. Here I've got my three cables plugged in. You can see on the touch sensor, I've got a purple cable plugged into the SIG port, and that's plugged into the digital pin 2 port on the Arduino Nano. I've also got a grey cable plugged into the BCC port on the touch sensor, and that goes into the 5 volt port on the Nano. I've also got a white cable connecting the two ground pins together. Once you've got the sensor plugged into your Arduino and the Arduino plugged into your computer, you can open up your Arduino program and we can begin making the program that we'll be running. So this is a pretty basic program. All it's going to do is just print out saying that the sensor's been touched or whenever it's been touched. I'm using an Arduino Nano, but you can use an Arduino Uno. It doesn't really matter. The code's going to work on both either way. I'll be putting a link to this code in the description. Check to make sure you've got the right port selected for your Arduino and then save it somewhere and then upload it. So once the program's uploaded, click on Tools and open up your Serial Monitor. And now if we get the Touch Sensor and start tapping on it, you should be able to see it'll print Touched to the Serial Monitor. You should be able to see on the back there's a metal plate there and that's the actual sensor, so if you click on that, it'll also uh, register as a touch as well. And if you hold down the touch sensor, it'll just continue printing. So what we're going to do now is add a bit more functionality to the program. So here we're going to make it flash the LED on the actual Arduino. So you just need to define the LED pin, which is just pin 13. We're also going to need to turn the LED off after you've stopped touching it. So we'll add a little else statement here, saying that if the touch sensor isn't being touched, it'll turn the LED off. So upload that. And open up your monitor again. And you should be able to press the sensor again, and this time it will also light up the LED on the Arduino. So you can see it's lighting up the LED next to the L label. Thanks for watching. I'll be doing a few more of these videos just explaining some various Arduino sensors. But if this is helpful for you, please leave a like and a comment down below. Thanks.